Oh, I'm still a little upset. I live in Ohio, grew up in Ohio, so you know, Super Bowl, my bingos failed. So, but let's get to the message. You know, once again, this so-called pastor, Greg Locke, is back in the news again. Now, a week or two ago, I made a video, uh, about a week ago, I made a video talking about where he was having a burning service of burning Ouija boards and uh, Harry Potter books, Twilight, all of this stuff. And, you know, I, so we talked about that. But then, if you don't know who past, this Pastor Greg Locke is, I mean, he's crazy, basically. But he's the same pastor that I, where I made a video a few weeks prior to that, where he talked about autism and cerebral palsy is possibly demonic and things like that. And, and, and we go back further, he's talking about if you come to his church with a mask on, he's going to ask you to leave. He also predicted that Trump would win and stood on it and still stands on it and and he stands up there and he's all shuffling and jiving up on the stage and he likes to showboat a whole lot. But guess what he's been done now? He's just on his previous service there that he just had, recent service here, he talks about he has six witches in his congregation. He said, there's six witches in the congregation and there's three of you out here right now. We've got your first and last names and one of you, we got the address. And, you know, basically, you coming in here casting spells and all of this crazy stuff, and, and, and we're going to throw you out of here. And if you don't leave, he said, next week I'm going to bring brooms up here and we're going to fly your, and he, like he almost sounded like he was going to say something, you know, a cuss word. And I thought to myself, I said, what kind of, pa you know, first off, he's a false pastor. And there's no anointing from God upon him or his church. You know, this guy left his wife and married somebody else within the church. So, I mean, so this guy has, you know, there's no anointing upon him. There's no anointing upon n none of this. God is not in the midst of none of this. And so I said it in the past that he works for Satan himself. He's just another worker that Satan has put out there that Satan has anointed and put out there along with all these others. So he's out there. So he wants to call come out. There's witches in the service. Uh, well, it wouldn't surprise me if you did have witches in there because, you know, everyone that's there under your spell uh, uh, as the head pastor. So no telling what you're attracting because you're, a, you know, a false pastor. So I just find it funny, you know, that because, I mean, if the spirit of God is within a place and yeah, witches come into a service like that. And let's just say if it was an anointed preacher, an anointed church and witches walk into that atmosphere, they may come. But you know what? The Holy Spirit is going to have them very uncomfortable. And guess what? The Holy Spirit and that word of God is going to slice them up. And, and see, there's no anointing there at Greg Locke's church. This guy is a fraud. This guy is a showboat. Uh, I, I mean, if you get a chance to ever look at some of his videos, take a look uh, at, at the craziness and the nonsense that he talks. And, you know, it, it, it's just funny because he has people, and, you know, and he's uh, somebody had wrote in a comment uh, before and told me that, uh, Ever since he was showcased on the news back on CNN or something, it seems like he's gotten a little more because of that attention. He's gotten a little more radical, you know, more so showboat. So, you know, it's a shame that uh, you got people like this heads over churches trying to lead people and setting under someone like that. Now he's just all of a sudden, I mean, he's obsessed with the cult and the, and the demonic like that. I mean, really? <laughs> so let's see if he, you know, if he's going to expose some names. Somebody, he's got your names and, and address. Yeah, so this guy, man, I mean, it's just always something. And this won't be the last time he's in the news. I just thought I would share that with you guys real quick. I find it funny that a false <laughs> pastor, somebody that's working for Satan himself, is set up there calling out 
so-called witches and who's to say there's you know who's what if there is witches out in this guy like where do you get that from this guy you know so oh it says it's hilarious it's hilarious really so i hope everybody's been doing well this is evangelism for god the channel that speaks about issues the church run away from and expose satan and his devices and put them on the run and punch them right in between the chops my name is Maurice Braxton. If you're new, consider subscribing. Hit like, coming along for the journey, because we're going to continue pushing forward, giving God all the glory, all the praise. Until the next video, my friends, take care. God bless.